Hi there, I'm Pam McGinnis, and today we're at the Dayton Playhouse with Tim Rezash, who is a board member here, but his current role is director of Murder on the Nile, which opens in about four weeks, November 2nd, I believe. So, Tim, talk to us about, about Murder on the Nile, Agatha Christie, you know, everyone knows, they're sort of familiar with it, but tell us sure. about the show. Uh, Murder on the Nile is the stage adaptation of the novel Death on the Nile, which many people may have read. Uh, Death on the Nile was written in 1937, and then the stage play adaptation was in 1948. So there was about a decade in between the two of them. Some of the characters are a little bit different. The plot point is basically the same. It's a, a typical whodunit from Agatha Christie. So there are um, 13 characters in the play, any of whom could have been responsible for the mayhem that happens. Uh, obviously, there is a death. And uh, at that point, then, what transpires from there is trying to figure out what happened and who done it. And what will audiences love about this show? Well, it's an interesting uh, play because there are, there are obviously a lot of suspense and there's a lot of mystery. There's a lot of humor in it, though, which I think is kind of fun. The characters are all very full. They're filled out characters. Many of them are there to be funny, I believe. So there are some, some foils in the plot line that way. There are a couple other characters, one in particular, that you have no idea why he's there. And you don't know until the very end of the play. And he just kind of walks around. He's on stage almost all the time. But there's really no purpose for him being there. And no one knows who or what he is. So that's kind of fun, too. All right, now talk about you, your cast, um, your set. I, this is kind of a costume-heavy show. It is. It, it is a period piece, so we're setting it um, somewhere between 37 and 48, okay. uh, but, but between when the novel was written and when the play came out. So um, we're, we're playing it as real as possible with the costumes. The set uh, has been designed to be very lush. This is on a boat that is cruising down the Nile and um, really is set for the affluent. So it's, it, the, the decor will be very rich, a lot of textures in it. It is also taking place in the observation deck of that ship. So the entire back will be mostly windows. So the, uh, what you've got is a nice view of what they're seeing as they're going down the Nile. Um, I'm really happy with the cast. We have a cast, many of whom have never performed at the Playhouse before and quite a few whom have never even auditioned at the Playhouse before. So it's going to be really fun, I think, to open up new actors to the theater. Opening up new actors always brings in new patrons who are wanting to see those actors. So hopefully it'll be a lot of fun for everybody. Okay, and this is the second show in the Dayton Playhouse 60th anniversary season. So I'm going to let Tim tell us how we can get tickets. Sure. Um, or in order to get tickets, the uh, easiest way to do it is to log in to www.daytonplayhouse.com and there is a little ticket icon that you can click on to go ahead and reserve tickets. Tickets can be reserved online and seats can be reserved online. So you don't have to wait and find out where you're going to sit. You can actually order tickets. You can print them out and bring them right to the theater. We open on November 2nd and run two weekends. Fridays and Saturdays are at 8 o'clock and Sundays are at 2. Sounds good. I hope everyone comes out to see Murder on the Nile by Agatha Christie.